He lost his hand in an accident on Christmas Eve, and today the 15-year-old sophomore got a new one, a prosthetic, just in time for prom. Lindsay Masses introduces us to this amazing young man. This is the day Washir Johnson has dreamed of for months. This is a start to very, very new beginnings. On Christmas Eve, Washir was helping his family cut baseboards with a miter saw for a home construction project. It caught my coat. And as it caught my coat, I tugged the, the saw and I tugged it down and the saw came down on top of me. And I actually, again, I saw my hand just fly. He cut a major artery. Doctors tried to save his hand, but his life was more important. The recovery was painful. Wyshear's mother, Patrice Gosley, says incredibly, her son has stayed upbeat. He wouldn't let us do anything for him. He said, let me try it first. If I can't get it, then I'll ask for help. But Washir did accept help to get this prosthetic hand before prom this weekend. It's called a myoelectric prosthesis. Picks up the electrical signals of the muscles. That means Washir will be able to tie his shoes, use utensils, and... Shaking. How does that feel? It feels normal. And now it's time for him to practice dancing. In Frederick, I'm Lindsay Mastis, 9 News Now. Many friends and family help raise $10,000 to help pay for the prosthetic hand, but they still need to raise at least 15000 more, and they're hoping insurance will pay for most of the $90,000 prosthetic.